Miley Cyrus reveals how she met her boyfriend, Max Miranda. Ariana Maddox says that she won't film with Tom Sandoval or Raquel Levis again. And Madison Roy opens up about Alex Rodriguez DMing her while he was engaged to J-Lo. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life with your news in entertainment and today we're kicking off with Megan Fox's stunning sheer look at the Sports Illustrated swimsuit launch in New York City, which she attended with Machine Gun Kelly. The cover girl stunned in a floor-length see-through black gown that showed off her ample cleavage and cinched waist. Megan rocked red hair and long hot pink nails as she was joined by her on-again, off-again fiance, MGK, although she wasn't wearing her engagement ring. Moving on to Ariana Maddox, who has declared that she will not film anymore with her ex, Tom Sandoval, and her former friend, Raquel Levis, after their affair. During an interview with the New York Times, the Vanderpump Rules star said, I have nothing to say to either of them. Our show is very real and follows a real group of friends, and neither of them are in the group of friends, so good luck. Ariana's interview with the New York Times dropped the same day that she confessed that she hates Tom and Raquel nearly equally during her appearance on The View. She said it's pretty neck and neck, but I would say him, talking to co-host Joy Behar, who asked who she hated more. She also explained that she's taking her healing process day by day, saying, I think it's a slow process to get there, but I think I'm just one day at a time, moment by moment, getting more and more to that place. And watching the episode last night, it really brings you back to that anger, that gut feeling, that anxiety that I felt. Well, I guess we'll have to wait and see what comes out of the next reunion episode. And speaking on Bravo stars, Southern Charm's Madison LaCroix opened up about Alex Rodriguez sliding into her DMs while he was engaged to JLo. The reality star was on a new podcast episode of The Pillows and Beer and claimed that A-Rod seemed like he was looking for a side chick while he was engaged to Jennifer back in 2020. Madison revealed she was shocked when she first heard from the former MLB player who messaged her in 2020 asking whether or not there were any gyms open during the COVID-19 pandemic. She recalled telling the podcast host Austin Kroll, who she used to date, that she thought she was being catfished. Madison later said that she called out Alex in the DMs, and after Austin explained that the MLB star would FaceTime Madison multiple times a day, she said that she told him, if you're looking for a side chick, which clearly he was, it wasn't going to be me. I'm wifey material. After the podcast was released, a representative for Alex denied Madison's claims in a statement to Page Six, saying her 15 minutes of fame are up and she's trying to get a 16th minute. Please stop wasting everyone's time with these false narratives. They were false two years ago and continue to be false. Well, who do you guys believe? Let me know in the comments below. And finally, Miley Cyrus sat down with British Vogue and revealed how her romance with boyfriend Max Miranda began. The Flowers singer confirmed that their relationship commenced a couple of summers back on a blind date. She told the outlet, we got put on a blind date. Well, it was blind for me, not really for him. I thought the worst that can happen is I leave. During her interview with the site, Max apparently called his girlfriend in the midst of it, and Miley revealed her special ringtone for him, which was Tyrone by Erica Badu, calling it the Boyfriend Sexy Ringtone. Recall Max and Miley first started dating in November 2021, and a source told Hollywood Life last spring that Miley has seemingly found her other half. We love that they're going strong. Get more details on Miley's interview in the links down below, and be sure to hit the sub, like, and bell button for more news on your favorite celebs. Bye, guys.